Hi, I'm Denise O'Malley. I'm the founder of You Define Wellness, and I hope that you've been enjoying the Defining Wellness Confab. This was an effort for us to introduce those who are on their own wellness plan path without, let's say, a primary care physician guiding them, to introduce them to health and wellness professionals that probably aren't covered under medical insurance. And what typically happens when you set out on your path by yourself is you, you kind of wander around. You go to Google and you to put in search terms and you find health and wellness directories out there and Yelp is one of them. And you don't really know a whole lot about the people behind it. So in the Defining Wellness Confab, I wanted to introduce people to 52 of the health and wellness professionals that I know so that they can get acquainted with them. And this is my presentation during the confab. And I've changed the title a couple of times, but here's what I've set on. Um, so you want to build an online network of health and well wellness professionals. Well, you may want to think twice about that. So there's a lot of reasons for this, but we're going to get into them here in a minute. Let me just get my slide going on. So what I'd like you to do is I want you to picture this scenario. You, scenario. You're sitting around with a bunch of your friends, maybe having a cup of coffee, and you're chit-chatting, and you're all in the health and wellness industry, and somebody says, hey, you know what we really need in this world? We need a network of health and wellness professionals. You know, a network where people can access a caregiver list of all these different modalities, because we all do different things, where the people accessing it can receive education and where we're building a community among the caregivers so that we can cross refer and get to know each other. You know, we're sitting around and we're going saying, we can work together to put this together. It shouldn't be that hard. We just need a website. Let's do it. Well, first of all, you're in good company. Um, every association seems to have one out there. And you know what? A lot of people have started them too. It seems as though I'm hearing of a new one literally at, at least once a month. But you know what? Don't let the fear of competition stop you. But now you're sitting there going, okay, now where do I start? So many times a year where a lot of people start is they pick up the phone and they call me or they send me an email and they will say to me, I want to do something like you define wellness. Will you teach me how to do it? Um, no, but I will share some things with you. So here's some things to ask yourself if you're sitting around and you want to create a new health and wellness provider directory on the internet. First of all, how are you going to fund it? From your checking account? Okay, that's fine. And a lot of people say, you know, websites aren't that expensive. No. They're not until you start adding things into it and plugins to host the directory and modules for payment and additional pages that you're um, adding to it. And suddenly it gets really quite cumbersome. But you need to know how to fund the setup. Are you going to build it yourself or are you going to hire it out? If you're going to hire it out, the costs go through the roof. There are some great people out there doing websites. But because this is so specialized, doing a provider directory, you, if you're hiring it out, it's someone who needs to know what they're doing. And it's going to cost you. Another question to ask yourself, how will you recruit listers, you know, the providers, to have listings in your directory? Will you allow just anyone to have a listing? And there are a lot of those out there. Hey, pay us a fee and you can have your own listing on our website. This goes hand in hand with that. Are you going to screen the applicants? There are a number of them out there. It's like, no, pay us a fee. You're, you got a listing. We're, we're not doing any screening. So my question to you now is if you're not going to be doing any screening, how much liability insurance are you planning on having? Because there are a lot of people that I know of that have criminal history, um, that have, are on many different health and wellness provider directories that are out there available on the internet. And I know that because we do a criminal background investigation at You Define Wellness. So um, that's one of the things that you need to be aware of is when you're putting people on your directory listing is, you know, what do you know about them? Uh, what do you know about their background? 
you need to know who's going to maintain the website. And there's, there's a lot to maintaining websites. I mean, something as simple as, okay, well, what happens when somebody doesn't pay their uh, fee every month or every year? Uh, what happens if their money bounces? Um, there's all kinds of little things that always have to be done on the website. So there's a lot of administration that needs to be done with it. Who's going to invest the time to do it? I have an outside service that does it but you may want to do it yourself and you need to allow for that time. How are you going to price your website? So if you're putting together a directory and there are a lot of them when they're first starting out, they're saying, hey, you can have a free listing. We'll give you a free 18 months and then you pay for the next 18 months so that we've got you know three years on here. Um, but what happens with them is when they give this free service, um, people don't opt to, can, to do the payment on it because they may not get ever a hit on it or it may be one new client, but hey, if you get one new client that pays your fee, you're good. But you know, how are you going to price your website? And I will tell you, I have found them out there that range between $15 and $59 per month just to have a listing on a website. So hey, you know, it could be a really lucrative business for you. You need to know how will you process the payments? What benefits will be offered to the listers? Uh, none, okay, uh, there are a lot of those. Uh, will you allow them to post their blog? What about articles and events that they're hosting? Uh, maybe offering a discount program. That brings up a whole nother subject. If you're going to be offering a discount program, are you going to mandate that the providers offer a certain discount? Um, you also need to ask yourself, are you going to be selling monthly memberships to the public to receive the discounts? I was contacted recently by one company who that's what their intention is. They want to sell monthly memberships to the public and they're going to negotiate the discounts with the providers, in some cases up to 60% off. So the company is mandating what the discount will be and they're going to be profiting by selling these monthly memberships to the public to be able to access your services and receive a discount. Somehow or another, I think that the only ones winning here are the company that hosts the website and the, the patients, but what about you? Um, and there was another whole component uh, there's a problem with doing that. When you are selling a monthly membership fee to the public for health and wellness and medical services, you need to know there are state laws regarding the sale of those medical discount programs. And I can tell you that there are states out there that will say, oh, so you are a medical discount program, and therefore we need to review your application before we will approve you to be a medical discount provider in our state, and some of them will charge you anywhere between eleven and twenty-two thousand dollars just to be reviewed. I don't know a lot of people who can do that or want to do that. So what I'm trying to tell you is this: there are an awful lot of questions before you decide to that. Hey, this wonderful idea of creating a an online health and wellness provider directory is a good idea. And I will also tell you that there is no easy button out there. It's going to take work. So let's go back to this original question of, hey, you know what we really need in this world is a network of health and wellness professionals. We can do it. Still think you want to launch one? If you do, great. Congratulations. I wish you the best of luck. Um, but I do have a better idea. Align with us. That's what we have at the heart of our company is a health and wellness provider directory. And um, I want to tell you a little bit about it and the benefits of aligning with us versus the headaches of trying to start it yourself. So my story is I did not set out to create an online provider directory. That just was a natural component of a bigger picture. What I did is I set out to create a way for people to access health and wellness professionals and how to pay for their services while ensuring the practitioner controlled their income, not me. That became you define wellness. And I want you to take a look at my logo. In the middle of the logo is a heart with an EKG line running through it. That represents the health and wellness practitioners in our network as the heart and lifeline of our organization. And I'm going to tell you that I am very serious about the practitioners being the heart of our company.
because without you, we do not have a product to sell. And our business model is about products and access to pay for your services, not to just recruit providers and expect you to pay us a monthly or annual fee. We are also about supporting you as an entrepreneur, and so we have set up some things to help you in that way. One is a meetup group that we have set up called Healthy Living Practitioners, and we currently have meetup groups in the Metro Denver, Colorado area, Northern Colorado, and Madison, Wisconsin. Yes, I know we jumped a few states there. It's just the way it happened. And we have more that are coming soon. We are, have also set up a Facebook group. Um, so that is open to anyone who is a health and wellness professional and wants to join our Facebook group. You are welcome to do so. Uh, we would love to have you in there and connect with other people. So that is a free thing for anyone, whether they decide to join our network or not. But for those who do join our network, we also have a private Facebook page. And we're using Facebook because it's just a universal platform that we can use. Yes, I know there's a lot of controversy about it, but you know what, it's working for us. But in our private Facebook page, our people can connect with one another. And the thing that I love seeing is when somebody posts about a client that they've had who has presented with certain issues that they can't handle or it's not in their expertise, and they are putting it out there to say, here's what's going on. Who do you recommend that I refer my client to? Oh my gosh, that's gold. It's fantastic. We are also committed to giving back to the community. And this was something that was driven by our providers in our network who wanted to be of service at time of crisis in the community so that we have established a workplace crisis support team where we can go in when a crisis has hit in the workplace and provide a variety of different modalities that for employees to learn about and sample for themselves so that as they are planning their healing journey through this crisis and past it, that they can choose from more than just counselors and psychotherapists. And yes, we bring them in too, but we're also going to bring in acupuncturists and massage therapists and energy healers and biofeedback and so much more. We're committed to giving you business exposure. Um, any of our providers at any time can request an apple a day um, conversation. And what this is, is a 20 minute conversation between you and I using the technology of Zoom, where I am just learning about your business and exploring the topics that you want out there so that you can get additional business exposure. We host it on YouTube, you can put it on your social media, you can put it on your website, you can do whatever you want with it, and I do not charge you a dime for that. So that is a benefit to all of our providers for being a part of our network. And we've also been, we've launched one, we hope to do more of these, and that's called Experiential Health and Wellness Happy Hour, where we invite corporate decision makers to come to an event to experience the different modalities. And in our first one, we had 30 tables set up. We invited the corporate leaders to come in. These take an awful lot of time to put together, and so until we have more feet on the street and more people willing to serve and volunteer to help with them, it's kind of on the back burner because it's very time consuming, it's very expensive for me to put those together, and we know our resources can be better used other ways, such as doing online um, events like this Defining Wellness Confab that we're doing. And I wanted to really beef up our YouTube library, a resource for people to go to to find people who can help them. And so I made the commitment that over an eight day period of time, over 11 days, that I would do 48 presentations. Anybody who wanted to participate in it, if I could squeeze them in, I did. Um, I'm almost done with it now. It's been at the most interesting and beautiful journey that I have done in a while for myself. And we're giving good content to the world and great business exposure to our providers. And in 20 minute conversations, either a presentation they're doing or an interview style with me, um, we're putting their message out there to the world. And we had already planned that next month in August, we're going to focus and highlight on the authors who are in our network. So many of the health and wellness professionals I know have written a book, and I want you guys to get publicity for it from me. I want to put it out there and put it in this Confab series and really, or the author series, and really give you some business exposure. 
And then it, this week has been going so well um, at, with the Defining Wellness Confab that I decided we're going to do them every July and every January. So we've already put together the theme for the January one. It will be the vision for healthy living. We have the date set. Um, we will be getting it, our providers to sign up for them very, very soon. Hopefully in the next week, we'll start getting those uh, signups for it. But we want to this to be a twice a year event with a, a theme for every one of them. And you know what? These are going so well. And it's such an it takes no manpower really to do these. And so it's not like the ex, the health happy hour that we um, did where we had 30 providers show up for it and it was great. But I don't have to exert a ton of my own personal resources and energy into doing them that we can do them online. And the beauty of it is, is that I can highlight providers who are not where I live. So we've had people talking from Madison, Wisconsin and Chicago, Illinois, and all over the place during this last two weeks. And we want to do more of that. So it doesn't matter where you, your office is, we can focus on your business in the um, defining wellness concepts, but they have gone so well that we are going to do them every month with a different theme every month. Um, they're not going to be as long as this one. <laughs> they're not gonna be eight days, they're either gonna be two or three days. And we will cram in as many providers as we can in those two or three days. And in September, we're gonna do something a little bit different. We're going to do one called Your Story Series. We, we will actually invite the public who are interested in sharing their own health journey to um, have a session where they can uh, share what they've had to go through and tell their story. And this came about because somebody just reached out to me and wants her story shared. And I thought, you know what, this is a really good idea. Let's do that. And some of our health and wellness professionals will be on there as well, sharing their journey. Because what I know is that so many of the independent health and wellness professionals are doing what they're doing because they had to find their own way either for themselves or a member of their family. And so let's tell those stories. Let's give inspiration to other people who are floundering around and don't know where to turn. Let's show them how you walked that path. And then in October, we're going to focus on those who have podcasts or on air radio shows for that matter too. So if um, you have a podcast that you do for health and wellness, you know, this is where we want to focus on and give you a little attention and, um, at increase your audience size. In November, well, you know what it's all about, Thanksgiving. So we're doing a series on Thanksgiving. That's two words with me, not one. And that's about giving gratitude and thanks. And you know what? It could be cooking demonstrations for healthy meals. It could be about how to adopt a, a lifestyle of gratitude. It could be talking about someone that you have gratitude for. It could be what, whatever you can come into a topic that fits in that description, we'll do it. And I like diversity. So I don't want everybody talking about gratitude. I want to have a diversity and a variety of different types of topics. December, well, we have the holidays and they're stressful. And so we are going to do one called the Happy Holiday Series. And it's about de-stressing. It's about um, dealing with family relationships at the holidays. It's about cooking healthy meals for the holidays. It's about managing your time. Um, it could be on uh, any subject that fits into that theme with the holidays and de-stressing. And in uh, February, of course, February is Valentine's Day. So we're going to focus about relationships. And this isn't just, you know, intimacy or couples. This could be about loving yourself. This could be about um, things to do with a loved one and uh, do some outings. It could be about couples massage. It could be, um, uh, you, can, you get the idea. It could be a wide variety of things. And then in March, we have St. Patrick's Day. So let's do one about creating your own luck. You know, we tend to look at people who have achieved some success in their life. And maybe it's with weight loss. Maybe it's in business. Maybe it's in love. Maybe it's in having kids, whatever it is. And we look at them and say, oh, they're so lucky. Well, you know what? We create our own luck. So let's talk about manifestation. Let's talk about um, taking control over your weight loss. Let's talk about whatever it may be. Um, and, uh, and who knows where we're going to take it. But I'm really excited about this lineup right now that we have for um, the next nine months or so. Um, 
Then, you know what, we also have opportunities to share your expertise in live group settings. We have a, a wellness education catalog. These are classes that have been created by and are conducted by our network providers, and they go into this catalog. And you can go to my website and download a free copy if you want. Um, so you can see some of the dozens of topics that we have in there. And some of them are available worldwide by using a platform like Zoom and doing it as a webinar. We are also now giving discounts on your own care as well as to the public. Um, we have created something called the Healthy Living Savings Card. This is a discount program. And um, we had it, it is available to the public. We sell it, it's, we sell it for $99. It's also another way for you to receive clients. If you're willing to accept a discount, you can have a listing in that directory as well for the Healthy Living Savings Card. And you know what, you set the discount amount. I don't, I don't really care what you do. Um, it's however you're wanting your, your business to be represented. And one of the things that we will be doing as soon as all the cards are issued, because this is a new program, we're just launching it, is that one card will be provided for free to each provider location as our thank you. Here's the reason why we're doing that. So many of you have said to me, hey, is there a way that I can get discounts on, you know, maybe I, using other providers in the network? Well, yeah, I want you guys to go to each other. And while so many of you have a courtesy discount you will extend to someone who's in also a health and wellness professional, a lot of you don't. And so this is a way for um, you to be to help taking care of yourself because you know, you've know you got a budget as well, right? So this is a $99 value for everyone who joins our network who will be receiving one of these cards. Cards will not be issued until September or October. And the most important thing is when you're part of our network, we have a flagship product that is an employee benefit program that gives employees access to you. And if this is an employer subsidized plan to encourage their employees to take care of themselves. And you know what? You receive your full retail rates if you choose. Some of our providers do it at a discount and that's up to you. I don't set any of that. You do. Um, but you know, if you normally charge, let's say, $75 for a massage, I'm going to pay you up to $60, the first $60 of it. So you get paid $60 from me. You get paid $15 from the client. A plus B equals your normal retail rates. Isn't that a fun thing? And isn't that the way it should be? And I wanted to share with you a comment that was on our private Facebook page that we have for our network from one of our providers who said, you know what, thanks Denise for all you do. I have a client, I saw a client for the third time from you to find wellness, plus she sent a referral. That's the way it's supposed to work. And our employee benefit program is just getting traction in the market. So I am thrilled that it is working as it's supposed to for our providers. So my question to you is this. Does this sound like a world you want to live in? If it is, join us. And here's how you join us. So there's a one-time fee of $500. And I want to be very, very clear about that. And I make sure that you heard me correctly. I said it's a one-time fee. It's not every month. It's not every year. Don't ask me how much is it going to be at, at renewal. You pay it one time and you're in. And I'm pausing because I want that to set in. Now, there are some discounts out there. So if you want to see if you qualify for one, email me. My email address is there at info at youdefinedwellness.com. And what it, where will there be a discount? So developing areas, uh, there, and that's generally outside of Metro Denver. So if you are in Wichita, Kansas, or upstate New York, or in you know Tallahassee, Florida, uh, yeah, we probably have a discount for you because we are not, we don't have employers in those areas and we're just getting traction. So contact me, I may have a discount for you. Um, but I will tell you, nothing really beats a deal that we have through the Defining Wellness Confab right now, and that is go to our YouTube channel. You know, go to youtube.com, put you Define Wellness in there. Um, uh, look for the playlist for the Defining Wellness Confab and go find the discussion between me and the Global Healing Collective. The Global Healing Collective is doing some really good work in the community and is something that all healers should be taking a look at. And we have put together a, a deal that benefits them and benefits you and or us with You Define Wellness. And, um, you know, go find that because you're not going to find anything that beats that. 
Um, and if you're looking for a payment plan or other joining levels, there are some joining levels, other joining levels, lower joining levels. You can't play with all the different parts that I showed you. Um, there's some restrictions, but you can go to our website and uh, go to how to become a provider and take a look at it. But if you're ready to go and join today, um, just go to youdefinewellness.com, click on become a provider on the menu bar, bar and then apply to join. And choose the lifetime provider. That is the $500 level. That is the best level. Even the discount plans, it beats the discount plans that we have on there or the other ways. It is the top of the line best way. And um, then complete the application and make the payment. And if by chance you happen to um, you know, qualify for a discount and it did not, for some reason, did not go through, or for some reason you forgot to enter it, um, don't worry, a refund will be made to you. We're not going to make money off of you when you qualified for something else. Now, I need to let you know that we don't accept just anyone. Um, we actually do have a due diligence process. I have a private investigator on my team, and we will do a criminal background investigation. And we will look, if you are in a licensed and regulated industry, we will look at those licenses and check for disciplinary actions and stipulations. We will look to make sure you are a legal business, and we will do a reputation check on you on the internet. And I don't mean this to scare you, but I am going to point, point it out to you because not everyone will pass the due diligence test, meaning if you know that there is something in your background, you probably want to have a conversation with me about it versus having it come out in that criminal background investigation. Because that we do understand there are some extenuating circumstances and there's always more to the story. Um, and so we need to evaluate it very, very closely. Once you're in our uh, accepted to our network, and once you're part of it, we just encourage you to participate in the opportunities and help us build community. This is a grassroots organization. I am not funded by any major insurance company or any major organization. This is grassroots. And um, help us build this community because we can't do our part to change the world without your help. And I really encourage you to reach out to me. And because of that, I'm giving you my cell phone number and my direct email address of denise at udefinedwellness.com. I sincerely encourage you to pick up the phone, give me a call, and, um, you know, let's talk. I would love to have you in our network. This is been an incredible journey for the past three and a half years for me. And it's something I'm extremely passionate about. And I, um, I want to share it with everyone and I want this to be in every state and I want at least a thousand locations in every state before I retire. And, um, it, it, it is a beautiful thing and it's a beautiful thing because of you guys, because of you guys stepping up and saying, what if we do this or can we do that? And if it makes good business sense, I'm going to implement it. So, um, I encourage you to reach out to us. Thank you for watching this video. I hope I answered some questions. If not reach out, you know how to get a hold of me and thank you and have a great day.